How to add a PDF or upload a PDF to our MailChimp. Hey everyone, welcome. I hope you're all doing great. In this video, I will show you how we can add our PDFs in MailChimp and how to also use them in email. So this way we can actually go ahead and uh, create an email and also add to the PDF there. But if you just want to upload a PDF to MailChimp, first of all, open up your MailChimp dashboard. And then from here, you would want to just go ahead and scroll down. Um, and you will find, I just minimize all of this. You will find the content place here. So just, you will find the content option or se a section here, and you want to just find my files. So just go ahead and click on my files, and then you can just go ahead and click on upload and you will find the option to upload a PDF on here. And now that basically you pretty much just uploaded your PDF, um, in your MailChimp. Now, how do we actually use this and how do we actually uh, add a PDF in our campaign or emails? It's also very simple. So I'm just going to go ahead and create an email here. So let's just go ahead and uh, do regular email um, just for the test here. And we are going to, obviously you would want to fill in all of this, but I'm just going to skip ahead and go to the content section of the email. You can select any template here. I'm just going to use this one as an example. And in here, if you want to add your uh, PDF file, what we can do is basically add a button. If you don't know how to do so, we can just basically uh, go to content here on the top left, click on button or not actually click on it, but drag and drop it. Uh, and I'm just going to drag it over here. You can feel free to add it wherever you want. Uh, and we can just go ahead and go to like after we actually click on the button itself, we have the options to change it now. So what we need to do is just go to the design aspect of the button and you can see here links to and it says web. But what we not, what we want to do is actually make it say file. This way we can actually go ahead and add our PDF file in here. So we can see now that it is a limit. It's limited to 10 megabytes, which is something you need to take note of. Uh, but we can just go ahead and click on add file and then upload from device. Or we can just select since we already uploaded it. But yeah, it doesn't really matter. And just go ahead and select your PDF file. And now we are pretty much done. It actually now uh, is going to open up the PDF once once somebody uh, opens up this button or clicks on it. Uh, basically, now we prevent that the email is actually going to include the PDF itself because it's not, we don't really want to send out huge emails. Uh, but at the same time, now we don't really need to have it in our Google Drive and so on. And now we can, people can just click on this button and it's just going to open up the PDF file for them. But let's say you have a file that is more than 10 megabytes. What do you actually do in that case? You can just go ahead and link to your Google Drive uh, which you can, you know, add your PDF in there, share the link, and you can just uh, switch this to become web. And then you would want to add the share link to your Google Drive in here instead. With that being said, this is pretty much the uh, tutorial on how to actually upload a PDF to your uh, MailChimp. Hopefully you found this video to be helpful and thanks for watching.